What do you guys think about doing a, a tribute to uh, Stevie Wonder? Chris and I, we, you know, we all said, yeah, that'd be great. You know, he's been a big part of our lives uh, musically since we were young, you know. And Stevie was interesting. He had all these number one hits, and none of them sounded like anything else on the radio at the time. He just had the rainbow of sound going on in his music, and um, uh, yeah, I followed it. My head was inside the speaker listening, trying to get every little nuance. <laughs> We met at a place, uh, at a club on the, on the south side called The Other Place. We would come in on our breaks and listen to each other. And one day Bobby and I started talking and then uh, we got a, uh, a job at the Cotton Club and then we landed the job at the Green Mill and started thinking seriously about developing something. And one of those times, was just a, uh, a milestone or just a point of realization where we went, whoa, wait a minute, you know, <laughs> something has happened, you know, we've all matured musically and individually and collectively, and it's, we should really concentrate on, on this group. And the bottom line is just um, making music. That's what we love to do. That's who we are individually and collectively. quite a while, you know, trying to prepare for this because it definitely wasn't easy. So what uh, was uh, challenging about this project was uh, finding ways to play these songs in ways that uh, were interesting or, you know, not like um, we're just going to play You Are the Sunshine of My Life like a lounge band and, and then we'll take solos and no, I kind of was looking for something else. So we changed them, some, some, some things in the songs and then tried to remain true to the essence of the songs. You know, and play them in our own personality. So to pay tribute to him, you know, we, you know, we want to do them just like he did them. You know, that's, that's, he, he's, we want to get our own personality. So we've been recording the last three days. It's really a unique thing that we're trying to do, and uh, it's, it's been pretty successful so far. So. Especially when these cats do records. Because <laughs> then my job's easy. I just hit record and they just do it. <laughs> Josh is a, a, a great guy, and it's a comfortable situation. He's um, our fourth set of ears, you know, somebody to ground us sometimes and you know just give us a different perspective they they do their thing and then you know i just i just make sure i listen as hard as i can and be able to provide some feedback <laughs> 